Y N say something. What to say? Huh? Your boyfriend Mark is flirting with that girl. Can't you see? He is not flirting. You know, he and Mira are childhood friends. They are meeting after a long time now. So they are happily talking to each other. I know they are meeting after a long time, blah blah. But they are not. But they are so close. Do you see how Mira is seeing your mark lovingly? Before Tina could say, I was noticing them. They are just excited each other after a long time. Nothing wrong. As I was about to talk, suddenly someone called me. Baby, I want to talk to you. You nodded. I held this party because of my sister is going to get married. What? I'm so happy for her. Where is she? She says she is on the way. Yeah, she is. Brother, they hug. Congrats, Arya. I am so happy for you. Why didn't you tell me before, huh? Everything happened so sudden that I don't have time for saying it. Why end? It's okay. Where's your fiance? He was about to come but got an important work to do. So he couldn't able to come to the party. Hmm. Oh, but next time you must show him. Arya nodded. Beauties, are you going to keep on talking or enjoy while dancing? Mm, what's it? We smiled and went towards Mark and started to dance, enjoying ourselves. Next morning. Slowly I woke up. Yesterday I enjoyed a lot. I smiled as I got up. Suddenly my phone rang. I took my phone and answered it. Hello. Vyan, where are you? I am waiting for you in the shopping mall. Come fast. Don't tell me you forgot that today we are going for shopping. Hmm. Ah, yes, Esther was drunk, so leave it. I'll be there soon. You ended the call. I got up quickly, got ready and left. I arrived at the shopping mall and was searching for Tina. As I was searching, I saw someone in wheelchair was about to fall from stress. I quickly ran and helped before he could fell. Thankfully, I pulled him and brought him to the side of the shop. Are you okay? He nodded. As I carefully looked at the person, he was so handsome, wearing a black suit, sitting on the wheelchair. As I was about to say, suddenly called. Boss, I am so sorry. Are you okay? He nodded. Boss, big problem. His bodyguard and him was keep on talking. As I was about to talk, suddenly Tina came. So I just left with her to the shop. As I was talking with my guard, I remembered of that girl. I turned and searched for her, but she was gone.
As days pass by, today is Arya's marriage. I was with her as she was getting ready, but suddenly I remembered I forgot my phone at home. So I arrived home and took my phone now and driving to the marriage. I'm so happy for Mira. I quickly arrived and went inside. Jungkook, your marriage suit has arrived. As a disability person, I was first insecure but later I made it my strength. Today is the big day. Arya, she is my love. We both met online. It was love at first sight as we became close. We met face to face. When we met face to face, I fell for her more. As we became closer, for a true relationship, we never hide any secret from each other. She knows me well as I as well as I know. Then we thought to get married. See, the day has came. I am so happy. I got ready and left for marriage. As I came, I was waiting for Arya to come. Mark came towards me. We hugged each other. Jungkook, can't wait to see to my sister. Huh? He teased. Sorry for teasing. I want to introduce you to my girlfriend. She is Vyan, my love. He said, bringing you. You? I see you both had met each other before. It is good. Vyan, he is Jungkook, my sister's fiancé. I was about to say, suddenly someone came running from the door. Saying the breed had ran away. We were shocked. I ran to her room but she was not there. We searched everywhere but she was not found. As we were searching, Jungkook was getting so angry. Mark, where is your sister? He asked angrily. I don't know. She is your sister and you don't know where she ha <laughs> ha. Now be ready to die, he said pointing the gun towards Mark. I was shocked to see Jungkook pointing the gun towards him. I heard someone whispering from behind. Jungkook is a mafia. We came here for free food but now it is getting dangerous so we better run away. Come, come. Jungkook is a mafia? I was shocked. Then thought he was about to shoot Mark. I quickly ran towards them and sat in front of Mark. Jungkook, Mark said he don't know. Why are you killing him? Leave him. You think I will believe him? Never, he said pointing the gun towards him. If you wanted to shoot him, you have to shoot me first, you said standing in front of Mark. Oh, I see you loved him deeply. Then be ready to die. As Jango pointed the gun towards me, who was standing in front of Mark, I slowly closed my eyes. Suddenly gun shot sound. You think I will kill easily? He said as he shot the wall. If I kill now, you will easily die. I want you to suffer. Mark, you must suffer. How I didn't have Arya, you must not have Vyan. Vyan, get ready. We are getting married now. What? Mark, you will suffer seeing your own girlfriend getting married to me. I want you to suffer daily. Vyan, now get ready for marriage. No, never, you shouted. it. 
Yes, you will marry me or I'll see your boyfriend dying in front of you. You choose.